Hi, my name is Vince Silvestri with ATG USA. And in this video, I'll be going through a brief overview and demonstrating how quickly you can create plan and profile sheets, as well as make revisions using the sheet generator tool within the CTC SIM project suite. So the sheet generator is comprised of eight separate tools. Uh, the workflow basically goes from left to right. Um, first one I'm gonna start with is the plan view shapes. Uh, the second tool uh, provided, uh, even though it says profile view tools, this is a link to the out of the box, create multiple profile views within Civil 3D. Once the profiles have been generated, our next step is going to be adding our pipe networks to the profile views. As you can see here, when it first imports your pipe networks, uh, there needs to be some adjustments made. So the fourth tool actually deals with that. Not only does it actually adjust the profile views, this actually links uh, your profile views to the plan view shapes we created in step one. So just select profile views. And notice some of our pipe networks need to be actually re added in. So we can just actually select the tool, select our profile views. Those are automatically brought back in. Next step is going to be the profile view shapes. So much like the plan view shapes define our viewports for our plan, profile views do the same thing for the profile views. So once our plan view and profile views have been defined, you can use the Create Layouts tool to generate the sheets. You should notice up here in the sheet set manager, not only does it create the actual sheets, it actually generates the sheet set, renames every sheet per the settings, in this case, per station range. So we'll take a look at the sheets. Notice how all the views, plan and profiles now match. One nice thing about the sheet generator tools is, for instance, this last sheet seems a little bit short. So one of the things that we can actually do is modify these pretty quickly. It's just a matter of redefining some parameters. In this case, we'll do a shift of minus 100 back. Now it's just a matter of selecting the tools that we need.
Selecting the profile view shapes again. So once our new limits for our plan and profiles have been defined, instead of actually creating layouts, since we've already have them created, now we're gonna use the update layouts tool, which is gonna append our current layouts and modify them to their new station ranges per sheet. So if you notice here, it actually goes through and matches old layout name versus the new one. These will automatically shift all your viewports to the new station ranges. So this has been a quick look at the sheet generator tools. Uh, if you're interested in taking a look and finding out more, um, please visit the CTC YouTube page for more information. Thank you. Hey there, thanks for tuning in. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and check out some of the other content on our channel.